gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to Robert Sports Show. I'm your host, Robert. All right. NCAA College Football Week Number Six. Wow, where's the season going so far? Oh, last week had a very intriguing week. We did every game. Um, I was 43 and 12 on the picks, 27 and 28 against the spread, 28 and 27 on the over/under. Year to date brings me 209 and 20, 209 and 53 on the win loss, 123 and 129 against the spread, over under of 135 and 117. Week six and beyond. We we'll cut that number down a little bit. We're going to do some of the more obviously I did every game there. Some of the weaker games is easy to pick, so I think it kind of maybe helped the numbers a little bit. We're going to cut that down. We're going to cut down the 27 games. I only did the games of the teams who have either one loss or no losses. So we have just the best of the best. Make it a little more difficult, but we'll see what we can do. Alright, first game, we have the American Conference. We have the Temple Owls, who are 3-1, versus the East Carolina Pirates, who are 3-2. The Owls are favored by 11.5. I got them winning. I got them covering at 11.5. I'm taking over, over on the 49. Next up, we have the 18th ranked UCF Knights, 4-1, versus the Cincinnati Bearcats, who are 3-1. The Knights are favored by 4. I got them winning, covering, and over on the 60. Next up, we have a battle of 3-1 teams. We have the Tulane Green Wave, 3-1, versus the Army West Point Black Knights, who are also 3-1. Tulane is favored by 3 on the road. Given the 3 to Army. Got Army covering the three and over on the 45 and a half. Next up, we have the Air Force Falcons who are three and one versus the Navy Midshipmen who are two and one. Falcons are favored by three and a half on the road. Who? I think the Air Force is going to take this over Navy. We got Air Force winning, covering that three and a half and under on the 44 and a half. Out of the ACC, we have the three and two Pittsburgh Panthers. Versus a 3-1 Duke Blue Devils. Duke is favored by 4 at home. Given the 4 to Pittsburgh, got them winning, covering, and over on the 48.5. Next up, one of the best games of the weekend, on paper at least, with the 14th ranked. Iowa Hawkeyes, 4-0 versus the 19th ranked Michigan Wolverines, 3-1. A huge Big Ten matchup here. Now, this could be, just could be, a preview of the Big Ten Championship game. As long as Ohio, or Iowa, excuse me, as long as Iowa can get through Minnesota and Wisconsin, there it goes, what they gotta do? Get through two undefeated teams, then they'll get there. Michigan, they have one loss, but if they can just get through Michigan State, Penn State, and Ohio State, they'll be there. So, in technically, yeah, no, it's not gonna happen. I know that, it's just, it's, um, I do have uh, Michigan spared by three and a half. Something about Iowa, I don't know what it is. It's something about Iowa I kind of like. I'm giving a three and a half to Hawkeyes. I got them winning, covering, taking over on the 47. Next up, we have the Kent State Golden Flashers 2 and 2 versus the eighth ranked Wishigan, oh, Wishigan, Wisconsin Badgers, who are 4 and 0. So Iowa needs Wisconsin to lose somewhere along the line or to beat them head to head. Wisconsin ain't losing here. They're favored by 36. They're covering the 36. Over on the 57. Next up, we have the two Purdue Boilermakers who are 1 and 3 versus the 12th Penn State Nittany Lions who are 4 and 0. Hey, Michigan, they don't need any hopes at all. They need Penn State to lose. That ain't happening here neither. Penn State wins, covers the 28, and over on the 56. Now, also, Iowa needs. Minnesota to lose. We have the Illinois Flat Fighting Illini, 2-2, two two, versus the 4-0 Minnesota Golden Gophers. That ain't happening here either. We have Minnesota winning, covering at 14, and over on the 58. I would, I was just going to have to beat them head-to-head, -head, I guess. All right, next up, yeah, we have the 25th-ranked Michigan State Spartans, who are 4-1. Versus the fourth ranked Ohio State Buckeyes, who are 5 and 0. Oh. Ooh, this could be a very intriguing game. Ohio State's favored by 19 and a half. I get the Buckeyes winning. 
I got the Spartans covering that 19 and a half and taking over on the 49. Next up, we go to the Big 12. With TCU Horn Frogs, 3 and 1, versus the Iowa State Cyclones, who are 2 and 2. Iowa State is favored by 3.5. I'm giving the 3.5 to TCU. We got them winning, covering it under on the 45. Next up, we have the 21st ranked Oklahoma State Cowboys, 4 and 1, versus the Texas Tech Red Raiders, who are 2 and 2. Cowboys favored by 10. Win, cover, over on the 62.5. It is the Big 12, y'all. They like to score points in the Big 12. Number 6 ranked Oklahoma Sooners, 4 0. Boom, our Sooner! Versus the Kansas Jayhawks, 2 and 3. Huh. There's going to be some booming going on here with some points. Sooners are favored by 32. I got them winning, covering, and over on the 67. Next up, the 4 0 Baylor Bears versus the Kansas State Jayhawks, who are 3 and 1. The Jayhawks are favored by a point and home. A point? That's a wash. I'm giving that point to Baylor. I got Baylor winning in Kansas. Sorry. Kansas State Jayhawks. I'm retarded. It's Kansas State Wildcats. Um, so in Kansas State, we have Baylor winning, covering the one point, and over on the 50 and a half. The 11th ranked Texas Longhorns, who are 3 1 versus the 3 1 West, West, yeah, West Virginia Mountaineers. The Longhorns are favored by 11. I got the Mountaineers covering the 11, over on the 60. Conference USA, we have the 0 and 5 Rice Owls versus the 3 and 1. UAB Blazers. Blazers are favored by 9.5. Win cover over on the 42.5. We go to the MAC. The West, Western Michigan Broncos 3 and 2 versus the 3 and 1 Toledo Rockets. Rockets are favored by 1.5. I got them winning covering. I'm taking under on the 68.5. Mountain West versus um, SEC. 3 and 1 Utah State Aggies versus the 5th ranked LSU Tigers who are 4 and 0. Tigers are favored by 28. When the Aggies cover the 28 and under on the 72 and a half. Next up, the San Diego State Aztecs 3 and 1 versus the 1 and 4 Colorado State Rams. Aztecs favored by 7 and a half. I got them win, cover, under, over on the 51 and a half. 16th ranked Boise State Broncos versus the 1 and 3 UNLV Rebels. Rebels. Let's see here. Boise State favored by 22. Win cover over on the 56. Some Pac-12 matchups. The Arizona Wildcats 3-1 versus the 3-1 Colorado Buffaloes. Buffaloes are favored by 4 at home. I'm giving a 4 to Arizona. I got Arizona winning, covering an over on the 63. Next up we have the 4-1 uh, California Golden Bears versus the 13th ranked Oregon Ducks or 3-1. The Duckies are favored by 17 and a half. I got California covering the 17 and a half. The Ducks winning and over on the 46. Next up, the 15th ranked Washington Huskies, 4 and 1 versus 2 and 3 Stanford Cardinals. Uh, Washington favored by 16 and a half. I got Stanford covering the 16 and a half and taking under on the 52. This may be the top matchup of the weekend. The 7th ranked Auburn Tigers, who are 5 and 0. Oh. Versus the 10th ranked Florida Gators, who are 5 and 0. Oh. Now, this could be a preview of the SEC title game. How do you ask? Okay. All Auburn's got to do beat the Gators, beat LSU, beat Alabama. How hard could that be? All Florida's got to do. Beat Georgia. I mean, really, everyone beats Georgia, right? And beat Missouri, who are 3 and 1. Well, no one beats Alabama, so Auburn, that uh, Iron Bowl would be very intriguing if both these teams are undefeated. Who beats LSU, especially at Death Valley? So we're in the swamp. Florida's pretty good in the swamp. Auburn's favored by three on the road. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I am doing it. I'm giving Florida the three. They cover them in the swamp. Under on the 48. Game of the weekend. Next up, we have the two and two Troy Trojans versus those three and one Missouri Tigers. Where did Missouri come from? They lost to Wyoming in week one. 
stonk up the place. Here they are, looking pretty good, sitting three and one, going against Troy. Yeah, Troy is a Sun Belt team. They are, I think it's Sun Belt. The Tigers are favorite, twenty four and a half. But, 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 they are coming off a of bye week. We all know what Mizzou does coming off a of bye week. They stink the place up. We'll see what Barry Odom has got in store for him. I am taking him to win. I got Troy covering at 24 and a half, and I am taking over on the or yeah over on the 65 and a half. Next up, those uh, third ranked Georgia Bulldogs who everyone beats. Yeah, right. No, they beat everyone. They're four zero versus the one and three t uh, Tennessee Volunteers. Georgia favored by 25. I got them winning covering over on the 52. And last but not least, we have the 4-0 Memphis Tigers versus the uh, University of Louisiana Monroe Warhawks 2-2. Tigers favored by 14 and a half. Win, uh, win. I am the Warhawks covering the 14 and a half, and under in the 64. Ladies and gentlemen, it is week six of the NCAA football season. We get 27 huge games here for you. Make sure you check out week 17 of the CFL here on Robert Sports Show. And make sure you check out week 5 of the NFL right here on Robert Sports Show. As always, thanks for... Yeah, I can't talk today. Yeah, it's going to be a fun day at work. I talk on the phone all day at work, and I talk here in videos. Great day. All right, well, thanks for watching Robert Sports Show. And don't just have a great day. Have a spiffy day. Robert Sports Show, your YouTube leader, Sports Show content.